late in the afternoon well, we just bought a male sheep uh, the one on this side because uh, our old one the other one died due to getting tangled up in our electric fence and I left it overnight I didn't realize it was on the fence on the electric tangled up so it was over all night and during the morning I didn't get to it till the next day turned it off but yeah well and truly he was totally shocked out of his mind literally so it must have gave a, a I don't know must have what do you call it um, took a toll on him because on his heart or, or something and probably mentally as well so just I saw it for weeks um, actually literally not just standing there not eating and so I eventually died while we were away but yeah so that one cost $250 Tongan that sheep there so hopefully we'll that's a bit of an investment thanks Pa for that and um, I just got our pigs back in they were out again I just turned the electric fence on so we'll see I'm gonna probably work on this tomorrow make sure they they uh, stay in I'll work on the fence the pigs are over there they're walking that way and uh, he got out on that side there this side so I've just blocked it all off in that hopefully they'll stay in here tonight and tomorrow while I fix the fence tomorrow and um, these two are okay though we went to Hangul we got that sheep from there but we we're looking for pigs like those little wieners they've got some pigs there but they're not um, big enough yet so yeah but it's three hundred dollars a pig getting expensive over here but I want a male a male Balangi male or what do you call it a white 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 overseas pig I think they're um can't remember what the the breeds called but anyway just because they're a lot tamer they don't jump fences as bad as the Tongan pigs do and dig and Tongan pigs are escape artists and they'll get out of anything but the Palangi pigs they learn I put electric fence up and whatnot they'll stay in I'll see how these pigs go the Tongan ones see if they start getting out again I'll have to shoot them I have to kill them for us to feed for a feed um, because otherwise the dogs or or someone else will shoot them so yeah see how they guys um i've got to go have a shower and get ready for church but uh yeah all right guys that's us today oh yeah one more thing have a look at this <laughs> oh the pups are there i got a load of sand for two hundred dollars this is all for two hundred dollars so this is going to help out our front front veranda and concrete a few things and our puppies are all on it hey what are you doing playing on our sand pit on the sand eh hey we're keeping this one here hey yeah Woo. having fun hey guys there's one must be at the back they're loving it but yeah so i'm gonna shovel that all over there finally can't get this concreted get the roof on got the poles in hey Zena, how are you girl hey your puppies she's sort of um not letting him suck suckle anymore so that's good they can survive on their own now all right guys that's me peace god bless